Hello everyone. Making a video on the Mavic Mini Fly More battery charger came with that kit. Uh, a lot of people don't understand how this works, I guess, because every time somebody posts something, it uh, they come up and are they like, is it quick charging or is it not? Well, the thing indicates and tells you if it's quick charging or not. If you look at the bottom of it, this is also for people that don't own it, the input. 5 volt, 9 volt, and 12 volt. All of them are 2 amps. I got a 5 volt. I got the one that comes with it, the brick, which does 9 volt. It does all three of them. It does all three of them at an amp and a half, it looks like, on the 12 volt. Normally with batteries, you want to charge them slow. So I don't know why people are like, oh my gosh, I got to get the fastest charger, which this is my fastest one so far. And then I have a battery backup, battery bank from Samsung. I use this all the time because it's a 10,000 milliamp and it can charge all three batteries on one charge, just barely. And then I have a one amp that I'm going to show you how it shows. And then a lot of people don't understand, does it charge all three at once, one at a time? And when you plug your controller in, does it charge this at the same time? I'll show you. So I'm going to start off with... The 5 volt. No, let's go with the fastest one. Plug that in. I use a USB C cable and um, an adapter. I'm going to plug that in. Get my books. That just plugs in. That way I never have to run this cord all the time. I'll plug this in. One battery is dead, and two are fully charged. It'll go through its little figuring out what's going on. Look how fast it's blinking. Very fast. Okay. Now I'm going to put the 5 volt 2 amp in. I think it's 2 amp. Mm, amp point. 1 amp. 5 volt. So there's a 9 volt, 5 volt, and 12 volt. Now I'm going to pull it out. Plug it into this. Now watch how slow it blinks. See, it's going so slow, it's going to test all the batteries again. Now, look how slow it's going. That is not fast charge. That's running 5 volt out of the 5, 9, and 12 volt that it can suck. Me, I want them to charge slow. Now, 10% to 100% on slow charge is about 45 minutes. I normally lower my batteries clear down to 5 to 10%. I normally fly back at 20 and then hover there and pull the photos off of it while it's hovering because it'll overheat just sitting there on the ground with not flying. So that's how I get my percentage down so low. So this is a quick charger that it comes with. Now I'll switch back. It's gonna re-figure everything out, but it's fast charging. So quit asking, is it fast charging or not? Okay, now, Here's my power bank from Samsung. Now when I go on the road, I have three batteries. So right there's about an hour's worth of flying. So when you use one battery, you can actually charge one battery up before you deplete the next two. So really you have four batteries. This charges it at three amp at five volt. And for some reason, it thinks it's fast charging. And it works great. Both. Put that in the other hole. Now it's going to charge. Say this battery was 50%. This battery 60%. You put them both in. It's going to charge the battery that's 60% first. Because it's closer to being full. And they want you to fly sooner. Now it only charges one at a time. This one's full. It'll switch to this one. Fill it up. It will not charge all three at once. Okay, now I have a 1 amp 5 volt. This thing's super old. I think the date code on it's like old. <laughs> now it has 1 amp at 5 volt. It should blink even slower, but for some reason it hasn't been doing it today. I go to make this video. Because I do a lot of charging in my car. I travel a lot. And there is a slower blink, but I can't get anything to make it do it other than in my car sometimes. But when you go to a slower charge than this, it flashes one light, 
and then flashes the next, and you're like, oh my gosh, it's never gonna get done. And then when it flashes, gets cleared at four, because as it's like 99%, it flashes all four. You think it's charged, but then all of a sudden they erase, because they're so slow. So I don't know what charge that is, because this is running five volt one amp, which seems like it'd be the slowest. So now, I'm going to charge it at the five volt. I never use this plug. 45 minutes for a charge of battery. I used to have a Holy Stone 720, and uh, it was a seven hour battery cycle, so I'm very happy with what this does. Okay, so now it's charging. Let's get all this crap out of the way for you guys. So it is charging a battery. Most people are like, okay, it can charge the controller at the same time. It is plugged in. It is not charging the battery. So to simulate all these are charged, I'm going to remove the empty one, and then it'll know they're charged, and it'll start charging that. Watch. Took the battery out. Now it thinks that whole thing's full, and it's going to start charging this. Which is nice, because if I go to bed and all these are dead the other day, I only had eight hours before I was going to fly it again. It charged all the batteries and this. And no matter what you plug this into, it quick charges. It flies across like that. It is not that big of a battery in this. I don't even know what size was in there. Then, it's also a power bank, which I haven't really used it for that. I don't know why you'd want to like waste a charge in these batteries when you can just buy a power bank for 10 bucks versus $49 for these. They're 44 on Amazon right now. But if you unplug the power... My power is unplugged. It is still charging it. And it's using one battery right now. There's a little button on the side. I don't know if it shuts it off. Who knows? It'd be nice if it had a light on it. And if I put another battery in, I don't know if it even continues to be a power bank. It continues. It doesn't even have interruption. It just gets it done. So all them people are out. Oh, it's now it's using the the lowest one to do it. I'll plug it back in. Because I need it later today. And now it's charging that. And it kicked off the charging to the controller. Now this one automatically switches between the two between the three but I always see it fast charging and I don't even know the fast charging time on it I feel it's almost the same so we're not just slow charge so your batteries last longer and also with this if you put a hot battery in it it will just blink say it's charging this one you put a hot battery in it it will still flash everything it'll keep telling you that battery's too hot to even test so it'll flash like a red light all the time it really looks like it's shortened out when it does it and it'll just keep charging this and then as soon as that battery's cooled off, it'll either switch to it or keep charging this and then go to that one. It's really nice. I like it. A lot better than my Holy Stone because it actually holds the batteries in there. That had a junk clip. And again, it only takes 45 minutes for slow charge. Hopefully you guys understand it better. Also, when you push these in, the clip is actually on the back. Pull that out. You think you're pushing down on this to release something in there? You're not. You're you're releasing this clip on the back. See that clip how it sticks out? When you push that in, see how it moves that in? That is where the clip's at. So if you're getting mad at it or it's really hot and it's a spongy plastic, which I've never had a problem with that yet, but I've had these type of clips before. Look at the back. Because if you break that and you're flying and this thing loses connection, your, your drone's coming out of the sky. You do not want that. Unless it, you want really good footage of a Mavic Mini flying out of the sky with no battery. Hopefully that helped you guys out.